So Jason Goodman apparently did something that has at least one third of the radio station angry at him for something he did. Katie? He heated up scallops <laughs> in the company microwave. Oh, I don't think it was one third. I think it was two thirds of the building. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe so. Oh, yeah, yeah. And joining us on the phone, we do have Josie who, um, <laughs> you know, I think actually can better describe the whole situation than we can because she witnessed it firsthand. Good morning, Josie. Good morning, guys. How are you? Hey, it's a we got a weird vibe going on. <laughs> it's, it's a weird. But anyway, what what happened? You caught Jason in the middle of it or what what happened? No, actually, I didn't. I so you know, my office is next to the break room and mm. I was down there working in my office and I heard someone in the break room, but I didn't know who it was. Mm -hmm. And so um, all of a sudden I, I, working and I smell what can only be described as um, dumpster fire, public restroom, on a hot day, stank death in the basement. Mm -hmm. And Because, you know, we, we work in a basement. And I am like, what just happened? And immediately I recognize it as some sort of shellfish has been heated up in the microwave. Oh, so I don't gross, know who's yeah. done it. I just, know, I just don't know. I know somebody's done it in the break room. Um, and there's only so many people that it could be. So I just kind of joked around that it was Jason, and I text and said, Jason, was it you? Now, at that moment, if Mr. Entitlement had just responded, yes, it's me, and I'm sorry, <laughs> it would have been end of story. <laughs> sure. But Mr. Manip but Mr. Who all of a sudden has got this weird thing going on with the break room where he's not emptying the dishwasher like everybody else. Mm -hmm. where he's not like everybody else. <laughs> I mean, I, let me tell you something. I have used one fork in the last 10 months. I have my own. I have my own. I swear on my life. I have my own in my desk. Okay. That's I have nice. my own cups so? and forks and plates in my desk. Mm -hmm. And did you pull one out of the dishwasher the other out. day because it was clean? I did pull one out. Did and you, I took so my. Did you empty the rest of the clean dishes? No, I did not. <sighs> but I don't think exactly. most people Everyone do else it. in that yeah, room has. I don't Jason think everybody. Goodman. I don't think Jared has. Have, Squid has. I've emptied the dishwasher before. I've done it multiple I've times. I've emptied the dishwasher. I never eat anything here, I but there's it. a time I did it. I've started the dishwasher before. Oh. Yeah. Uh -huh. Now, I think I we should get rid of, rid of the dishwasher. <laughs> 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 then what would you do we'll with all those dirty dishes? I don't have them because I have my own stuff. Jason, I listen, I. I love you, man. I do. That's the truth. But I'm telling you right now, I know for a fact after years of working with you that you are a guilty party in leaving a ton of dishes down in the sink. That is not yeah. true anymore. And, anymore. Ten years ago. Anymore. <laughs> Ten years ago, uh -huh. I did that. Okay. Ever since then, I if I ever use a cup or anything, which is very rare, mm -hmm. I <laughs> wash it with the stupid spray that comes outside with a button on and, and my fingers and mm -hmm. the little rag and everything. <laughs> I wash it. But I'm telling you right now, 99% of everything I do is either paper, plastic, or the most... Unrecyclable stuff I could possibly oh, yeah. <laughs> specifically <laughs> 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 just... I stopped going down into the break room using the cups and the forks and the knives and this and the sink because every day I felt like I was on dishwasher duty and I despised it. I, I think we should not have the dishwasher. Well, but I, we, what we do. But I don't use it we do. anymore except for that so, one particular time in an emergency. Talk about entitlement, like because you don't want it, no one, don't want it. no one else wants it. No, <laughs> I just don't want to use it. <laughs> right. Then don't use it. Then don't use it. Like yeah. for real, don't use it. Okay, I, I'll tell you something. Besides the last week, I don't think I've used it in five years. I haven't taken anything. A plate or anything. I have, I have plastic every cart and you could possibly imagine from my house so I don't have to deal with it. But I have an, emer <laughs> I have an emergency situation. Mm -hmm. Okay. It, it, it doesn't matter, Jason. It's the fact that we all work together. Like, if you use the last of the toilet paper, you don't leave the empty roll just because you're not going in there the rest 100%, of the day. 100%. But you let me ask you something, Jason. I haven't, I haven't used the dishwasher except for taking that fork out in years. And every single time I do walk by it, I see dishes in there. They're not mine. But somebody in this building is leaving cups and dishes and glasses every single day in it. They're, no, no, no. The, in the sink or the dishwasher? Sink. Okay. Well, that's because the cleaning people put them in there. Because remember the one time I said to you, you said, well, the cleaning people will clean the dishes. And I looked at you and said, no, that's the one thing they don't do. Katie and I have been doing the dishes. So every where are day. all these dishes and cups and coming from then? Somebody's using them. Jason's uh, bringing his habits from home know. here. He says the cleaning people take care. of <laughs> The cleaning people will do <laughs> it. I'm, seriously like, I'm not using those. I never use glasses. I never use cups hardly ever. But I do see them. So even mm -hmm. if the cleaning people are putting them in the the sink, somebody is doing it. 
Well, and then I am, so what I do is when I see that is I take the dishes out of the sink and I think of Katie, Matt, Barrett, Megan, Joe, Craig, and anyone else that is a team player then takes those dishes out of the sink rather than getting angry and just puts them in the dishwasher, starts the dishwasher, and we go on about our day. Mm-hmm. And well, it doesn't even come back to mind. Let's get back to the stinky fish. Yeah. <laughs> the stinky scallops okay. in the oh, microwave. Yeah. So, mm-hmm. well, the, the dishwasher was already, a, it, you know, I was already frustrated because I had asked him to, like, if you're going to use a dish, please empty the dishwasher because someone has to do it. So then I go in the break room, and I'm like, this smell is not going to go anywhere. It smells. So I text the group and say, Jason, did you just heat up fish? It's not fish. <laughs> it's not I fish. said. <laughs> that was on our group Loop text. Loophole Goodman. Yeah. Loophole Goodman. It's I not said, fish. exactly. So I wrote back, I'm sorry, capital S-H-E-L-L fish. <laughs> Yeah, they were scallops. <laughs> they were <probably> scallops. Totes <laughs> different. <laughs> and I said, mm-hmm. nothing is wrong with scallops. They're delicious. You don't reheat them in a microwave in a communal break room mm-hmm. downstairs because they stink so badly. And the problem is, is that was Monday at, what, about 1 o'clock? Uh. Yesterday at 3 o'clock, one of our accountants was reheating her coffee in the mm. microwave, and she pulled it out and said, why does my coffee taste, taste like rotten fish? Mm. <laughs> and I said, go Delicious. talk to Goodman. Delicious. <laughs> mm-hmm. uh-huh. And then, Matt, you said you walked out in the hallway, and you were, what? Yeah, because I got the text message from Josie in the group, and I thought to myself, it, it can't be that bad, mm-hmm. right? I mean, it, it's usually contained downstairs. So It'll I was be a going stink, and that's it. Right, because I was going downstairs to do something, and the moment I stepped out of the studio and walked toward the steps, I was like... Oh, God. <laughs> I thought it was coming out of Jason's office because that's where he had eaten it. And it just got stronger and stronger and stronger. The whole basement smelled like a dock. Wow. It does smell like a wharf. Yes. It does. I got ice from the, uh, from the refrigerator into my cup this morning. And even this morning, I'm like, the f- microwave, which sits right beside the refrigerator, it's closed and it's still permeating out. Like, if you stand mm. right in front of it, you can still smell a wharf coming out mm-hmm. of the microwave. Interesting. Because normally someone bad. goes down there in the morning and will make a pot of coffee. Yep. And several people will share it. No coffee today. No Nobody's coffee. Nobody's going down there. <laughs> they say to us, yeah. you better call them out. And we're like, mm, okay, all right. Okay. Interesting. I didn't, I didn't realize the scallops smelt that uh, potent when you heat them up. I think it's oh, different it? when you're the one heating them up. Because I've heated up broccoli before. Oh, and it's I will, And it's disgusting. Oh, yeah. And it yeah. Smells, it smells like farts. farts. Yeah. And I get it. And people have said, have said to my face, could you not do that? Yes, and I'm stinks. like, okay, yes. Or or at least I'll try to heat it up and then eat it down in the break room and then clean the dish really quickly, right? Right, right. So, because people have said it to my face and I'm like, okay, I get it. I get it. This is, if you're not the one eating the scallops, it's more potent. You want to yeah. die. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I didn't realize that. I mean, I, here's two things that happened. One, I'm not 100% sure the scallops were actually good. <laughs> I think they might have been <laughs> on their way out. <laughs> on the way, way out. Oh, you could have died. Yeah, yeah, that would so been good. I, I wasn't sure because I, I, I just started eating more scallops because of this Mediterranean diet kick. Mm-hmm. So I'm trying to eat a lot more seafood. So there's only a limited amount of food that I typically eat now. So when I did the scallops at home, a lot of people at home said, more than usual, ooh, I can smell those. Mm-hmm. So I'm like, huh. But they didn't say smell bad. They just said they could smell those. So when I brought them to work, I heated them up because I didn't want them to go bad. But I did notice there was more of a scent of the scallops. So I did heat them up. But here's the funny part is um, yesterday I heated up some shrimp, too. Oh, oh he doesn't want Oh, my and, God. And nobody God. noticed. Nobody noticed. Because it still reeks. So perfect. <laughs> now the, uh, the scallops is hiding the shrimp smell. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> well, uh, we had this. Uh, Josie and Katie had this put together for you. Uh, just to remind mm-hmm. everybody. Mm-hmm. I know I should empty out the break room dishwasher, but I won't. I'll pretend <laughs> I didn't say. <laughs> oh, well. Let someone else deal with it. Fly and say I never used it. Blame it all on That's Jared. That's not true. <laughs> I do what's best for me. <laughs> don't care about you. Cause I'll be selfish soon. I'll be selfish soon. I know I'm a narcissist. I know I'm unlikable. But I'll be selfish soon. I'll be selfish soon. I'll reheat fish if I wanna. In the break room if I wanna. I'll address shame if I wanna. Steal Katie's pepperoni yeah. if I wanna. <laughs> I'ma do what I wanna. 
Katie the morning. Nice. I will say this. There is 80, so many more guilty people than me. And yes, I have now this Michelle I'll get and I have to do that. But the second thing is that's the one thing I did pull out in that emergency situation. I don't use dishes. And you know what? From this day forward, you will never, ever see me with a company dish or anything because I want nothing to do with it. This is my thing. Okay. I got my plates. I got my plastic cups. I've got my plastic uh, forks and spoons and knives. Mm -hmm. Don't need that. Okay. Josie, thank you for writing that yes, song. Yes, thank you, Josie. <laughs> yes. Well done. All right. But we'll see you later. <laughs> <laughs> so catchy. I've been singing it all yeah. morning. <laughs> <laughs> Josie and I had nothing to do with that song, but I support it. But we enjoy it. It was entertaining.